I'm Guinevere, but most people call me Gwen. I'm the Lady Morgana's maid. Right. I'm Merlin. Mm. Hello, most people just call me idiot. I need some help with this fastening. Gwen? I'm here. Come on, Gwen. I thought you liked those real rough, tough, save the world kind of men. No, I like much more ordinary men like you. <laughs> Gwen, believe me, I'm not ordinary. No, I didn't mean you. Obviously, not you. But just, you know, I like much more ordinary men. Like you. Thanks. I guess you know what to do with the helmet. Um, yeah, yeah, that was the only bit I'd figured out. <laughs> How come you're so much better at this than me? I'm the blacksmith's daughter. <laughs> I know pretty much everything there is to know about armor, which is actually kind of sad. No, it's brilliant. <laughs> Hello, Merlin. All right. So I've got your flowers. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, would you like one? A purple one? Purple suits you. And not that I'm saying that red doesn't suit you. Thanks. Well, uh... Uh, see you. Bye. I'm psychic. <laughs> no, you're not. It's true. All right, what am I thinking? That I'm not psychic. <laughs> you're strange. I, I, don't, I don't mean that in a nasty way. You're just... funny. I like that. Thank you. What for? Coming to see me. <laughs> nice hat. Thanks. That's disgusting. You should be ashamed of yourself. You're old enough to be her grandfather. Merlin. <laughs> You're alive. No, and the ghosts come back to haunt you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just... I thought you were dead. It's fine. Oh, don't thank me. Thank Merlin. Merlin would do anything for anyone, wouldn't you, Merlin? I'm sorry. He's not really my type. Oh, well, there's a surprise. Sometimes, Guinevere. I wonder if you'd know what your type was if you're standing right next to you. You're probably right. Oh. So how does it feel to be servant to the Crown Prince of Camelot? Washing his royal socks will be even more of a privilege. <laughs> You're proud of him, really, even though you complain about him constantly. No, I am not. You are, I can see it in your face. So, come on. Just for the sake of argument, if you had to, Arthur or Lancelot. <laughs> but I don't have to and I never will. Oh, you are no fun, Gwen. <laughs> Merlin, what are you doing here? I've come to ask a favour. Yes? I'm not sure how to ask it. Ask Merlin, you know I'd grant you anything. I mean, not anything. Obviously not anything. <laughs> Tell me how it feels. Yeah. Yeah, it feels, that feels really good. It's very, um, you know, sordy. Gwen? How are you doing? I was about to ask you the same question. I'm fine. Morgan has been amazing these last few days. I think you've been amazing. I've tried to make her feel comfortable. You have such a good heart, Gwen. Don't ever lose that. Where's Arthur? He's cooking me dinner. Arthur's cooking. Melon? I'm sure there's an obvious explanation. There is. Which is? Moths. Moths? Yes, passes over run with them. Really? Melon, can't you knock? Rats. What? Big, hairy, sharp teeth. Uh, yeah, definitely under here. Feeling all right. I was just checking that they hadn't got in here as well. And have they? That's, that's totally infested. I have to burn it. Burn it? Yeah. I wonder if 
we don't stop them, we'll all be walking around naked. <clears throat> I'm really not sure it suits you, Merlin. Warts and farts and all. Merlin, I haven't got any warts. Arthur's a donkey. He has the ears of a donkey. And the voice. He's brain. He's brain? What? <clears throat> <laughs> it's not funny, Merlin. No, 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 of course not. Arthur with the ears of a donkey was funny about that. <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. Although some credit must go to my servant, Merlin. Dispatch a patrol. I want these men caught and brought to justice. All I know is you're back home safe with your friends. You don't have to face this alone. Gwen, you look after Merlin, won't you? <laughs> What's he actually doing? Thinking. About. You. And you're gonna stay here and watch. Gwen, this is one of the most important days in a prince's life. Forget he's Prince Arthur and that he can be a spoiled, arrogant brat. <laughs> You look lovely. <laughs> I can't trust anyone. In fact, I think you, Merlin, are the only person I can trust. I know, I'm late. I'm coming. Feels like I can trust no one anymore. Is that how you see it, man? Guinevere! Arthur! <laughs> what is that? Arthur's socks? Merlin! How are you, Gwen? I'm all right, I think. Merlin? You will take care of him. Doesn't always make it easy. I know. I haven't seen him this happy in a long time. Yes. He has changed, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, I think he has. Sorry. Fill that up, will you, Miller? Oh, perhaps he's not totally changed. <laughs> the sorcerer in the battle, you knew who he was. Yes. Do I know him? Please, guys, answer me honestly. Yes. <gasps> He'll take good care of Arthur. Yes, I'm sure he will. I'm pleased. <laughs>